Celebration in Waianae today for UFC fighters Max Holloway and Yancy Medeiros. The two winners in the latest UFC event returned from Brazil earlier this week, Holloway carrying the featherweight champion title belt. And this morning, hundreds of people welcomed both with open arms on the west side, their hometown. Sarah Madison and photographer Greg Lau were at the homecoming parade, and Sarah joins us with more. Sarah? Kathy, definitely a busy day in Waianae. It's safe to say that many believe these fighters bring hope and inspiration to communities on the west side. And now that Holloway fought his way to the top in the UFC, his next challenge is to get a UFC event here in Hawaii. Rain or shine, supporters waved signs and cheered for their heroes. Because when something great comes out of Waianae, the entire community rallies together. I mean, we have bad reputation right now. These two kids really show them that there are a lot of good boys around. Many here are MMA fans, but majority just love Max Holloway. He was the underdog. He went up there and he did his thing. He came back with the bell, you know, and make us all so proud. We have a lot of kids out here that looks up to him. Madaris, you know? There's another local boat out here that has done so well. The support is so unreal, like, it makes me want to bring another belt home. Best crowd. The world's best crowd. At the end of the parade, congressional, state, and city representatives presented plaques to both Holloway and Maderos. Mayor Kurt Codwell also made a resolution to name this day after the two fighters. I'm getting surprised all the time, and um, I'm just blessed, man, you know. Holloway's next challenge is to get a UFC fight here in Hawaii. Congresswoman Tulsi Gabbard agrees. There's so much attention being focused on what these two uh, great athletes from Y and I have accomplished. Let's capitalize on it and start to build up momentum. We asked Max Holloway where he would like to see a UFC fight here in Hawaii. And he said in his heart he would like to have it here in Y and I. But he could also see it happen at Aloha Stadium. And we had a lot of people that was from Townside that came to the airport. So. And even the UFC PR said this is the craziest thing they ever saw happen uh, um, with all the other champions. They said there's no other champion that got this kind of reception. Officials at the state and city level are also ready to make it happen. We want to work together for the city and the state just to make this happen. You know, everyone should just do everything that we can to support this. It would uh, stimulate our economy. We don't have a football team. We don't have a real basketball team. But we do have Max Holloway and Yancy Maderis. We got all the reps and stuff behind us now, and we just got to keep pushing. You see a why you better have it now. Later in sports, Sam Spangler looks into the history of mixed martial arts in Hawaii and that factor in getting a UFC event in our islands. Sarah Madison, KHON2 News.